Hey, I just finished watching the final episode of SmackDown Live. I mean, Friday Night SmackDown. And... As a show, it was good, but as a go-home show, it was awesome at the end. Especially with the edicts of John Cena and The Fiend. And before I go to that, just wanted to say that uh, let's just go at the start. As we have the um, the SmackDown Women's Champion Bailey and their friend Sasha coming out. And then we get this triple threat women's match with Tamina, Lacey Evans, and Naomi. And Tamina wins. Again, she's dominated again. But, you know, I think Sasha might win. I don't want Tamina to win. I want Sasha to win. Anyways. Uh, Tamina won the triple threat, and then we already got a replay. Thank God it was only one replay, but the problem was that was like half an hour. Jeez. They really uh, low on time or something? Anyways, there's a replay of Ric Flair versus Shawn Michaels. I didn't care. So, after that we got... The Usos and uh, the New Day and the Miz all talk about how they are gonna uh, achieve the titles. And I'm gonna be honest here, I forgot that was Miz TV because, quite quite fran- frankly, um. That did not feel like Miss TV. That was like the worst episode ever. Like for real, they didn't even go to their introductions. It was first the Usos and then the New Day and then Ms. Morrison. Yeah, they brawled. There were lathers everywhere. And then after that, we got oh, I mean we got Tucker versus Dolph Ziggler and. It was end of the disqualification, and I figured that happened. But then we get a, we get a glitch. What I mean by a glitch, a hacker that told everything, literally everything. And it turns out that Sonya Deville is still a heel. <laughs> Like, we didn't know that already. So, yeah. Apparently, Sonya de- deleted all the messages that Mandy uh, sent it, or what Otis sent. I don't know what she deleted, but that's all. And then, I guess Mandy and Sonya have broken up as a tag team. It kind of sucks because. We barely even have any tag teams for the uh, tag titles. Yeah. And then we got. What did we get? Oh, yeah, we got Daniel Bryan versus Shinsuke Nakamura, which got interrupted by Cesaro and uh, Sami Zayn. Obviously, heels have to win it. And also, they won't get booze, so they don't care. And yeah. And then, we got... Bray... I mean, we got John Cena... Being real. Well, not real, but being real. About what's gonna happen on Saturday and Sunday. Yep. And then, we got... Everyone from the Firefly Funhouse entering the arena. They were all at the barricades. And I forget what they said, but the last thing uh, I heard was Fiend at the, what do we call it? It's like a crane or I don't know what it is, but we saw that. And... We saw 
the non-masked Bray Wyatt saying, Let me in. Yep. So that was a good SmackDown. I'll give it like 7.8 out of 10. I thought it was, I thought it was good. Anyways, hope you guys enjoyed this. You did. Awesome. Anyways, goodbye. Wait, before you go, I have a prediction video coming up in like 10 to 15 hours from now. And I hope you see it. And goodbye.